Yeah, what's up guys? Um, so I just want to do a little introduction before we go into the interview. So my friend Sam, he's a professional vegan boxer, he's got a record of 6'2". He's, he's been vegan for two years. And I'm sorry about the background sound, I just didn't have my microphone with me. I did it, I did have it, but with some issues basically. Uh, yeah, so um, I just want to welcome everyone, all the new subscribers and people who are perhaps watching my video for the first time. I just basically want to quickly express what this channel really is about. It's about living a good life. It's about it's about sharing information for free and creating almost like a university, like a like a like a life university, a TV show, if you will, of just sharing knowledge regarding fitness and health and happiness and how to find a place in life, how to be happy, how to achieve uh, all your dreams and you know make them a reality. And it's all about living a good life, you know, health, fitness, entertainment, education. This channel is trying to appeal to everyone around the world and I want to start a health revolution worldwide and help people get fit as healthy as possible that's why I have nine YouTube channels you know and my, like but I'm gonna focus on university now because I already had two days I didn't do any almost I did some studying but very little I need to write my essays get on it uh, but the, enjoy the interview uh, I'm gonna link down Sam's channel below some Instagram account and Beth she's a tattoo artist she's his girlfriend you know shout out to Beth uh, you know I have I know a lot of vegan friends and I'm, I'm here to build a community here to help people it's not this channel is not just for vegans or, and you know this channel is for everyone who's interested in living a good life it's I'm just sharing my life with you no BS no filters nothing none of this hi guys fake bullshit Sometimes there's going to be some pranks, sometimes there's going, to be, there's going to be a lot of stuff on here. It's about variety for me. Life, I find, is more fulfilling when I do a lot of different things and have a lot of different interests. Enjoy the interview. Comment down below what you think. Follow Sam. Uh, they got, they got a big following there on Instagram. But uh, Sam, get on YouTube if you're watching this. Uh, you know, he's... Yeah, it's, it's a tough, it's tough, it's tough being a professional athlete. It's not easy. A lot of people don't understand this. It's only, only, only a small percentage of athletes get to the top. So yeah, enjoy the video, subscribe for more, hit the notification button, uh, I'll be making videos for you, my subscribers, and work, I'll be working very hard, uh, I'm always here for you, to support you, uh, nutrition, health, motivation, all that good stuff, and uh, I just share my life, sharing, sharing the secrets to a happy life, yeah, anyway, enjoy the interview, peace, alright, thanks guys, subscribe, and share the video. Uh, yeah, what's up, guys? So, as I promised you, the interview with a good friend of mine, Sam. Uh, say hello. Uh, so, he, I've met him in 2016. I met him. He's going through my vegan journey. I met him at this uh, restaurant called Sweet Greens in Bournemouth. And, uh, yeah, so he's a professional boxer. Uh, he's vegan. And he's got, check out his shirt, the vegan army re represent. So, uh, yeah, do you want to introduce yourself? Talk about how you uh, discovered veganism and how that like, helped you as an athlete. Uh, talk yeah. about that. So, um, so my name's Sam Jones, uh, I've been vegan for around two and a half years now. Um, first went vegan purely just for uh, just to improve my health and just to try and give me a bit of an edge as, as an athlete. And um, about six months into it I really realised about um, you know all the all the terrible things that have been happening to the animals and stuff. So that's when I really kind of made the connection with the animals and, and veganism, you know, put the two two and two together. And um, yeah, it's really helped me a lot with my um, uh, support, especially with boxing. It's helped me keep my weight down, um, keep my energy high. A few years ago, before I turned vegan, I was um, training twice a day, but I had to go and sleep um, around midday. I have to go and every day and have a nap. Uh, since I turned vegan, I've, that's just gone. Like, no more do I do a nap in the middle of the day. I train in the morning, then I train in the evening um, without an issue. So it's, yeah, it's been really good for energy. Yeah, so sorry guys about the background music. I just got my new phone and the microphone doesn't fit. I forgot the adapter. So, like, how about what about recovery? I've noticed uh, recovery time, like recovery is much much better. Have you well, noticed that? Yeah, well, yeah, recovery time is good. Um, I actually broke my right hand in December last year, and that was in cast for two weeks. And then I had the checkup, and they took it straight out of the cast, and they said it's healing amazing. Um, this is, you know, someone who's supposedly lacking calcium from milk, but obviously I've had yeah. no milk, and my hand was healing super fast. And um, I thought, I think it was, 
only eight weeks after breaking my hand, I fought again, I think it was. And, you know, I won. I won with my broken hand, and then I won in the fight after breaking my hand. It healed, you know, healed well, it healed, healed good. I get a little bit of pain every now and then, but that's just to be expected. But, yeah, otherwise, you know, my bones are healing fast, my muscles are recovering fast. It's, um, yeah, it's good. Have you, have you found, like, when you uh, in, in fights, have you found you have, like, more cardio, just, like, energy left during the fight? Have you found that? Or, like, because I, I, yeah. I feel like when I carve up, eat a lot of carbohydrates before, or drink some sugar water, I feel like I have the fuel to go yeah, yeah, yeah. What, what I really find is, um, when, when I weigh in, you know, I go to weigh in for a boxing fight, I'm not starving myself to, during that week trying to get down to the weight. I'm still eating well, I'm still, you know, like Ivan said, I'm still full of carbs, you know, I'm eating carbs. So, my opponent, nine times out of ten, has cut all of that stuff out of his diet, so he's really, he's draining himself to make the weight. Whereas, you know, I'm not doing that, I think that's what might give me the edge in the um, yeah. cardio and energy side of things on the day. Yeah, so, I mean, uh, Nick Diaz and uh, Nate, yeah. they were talking about how they, they were going raw vegan to, to get the weight down, and they have yeah, issues, yeah. and um, I think, like, a lot of these UFC fighters right now, like, uh, you know, uh, Darren Till? Yeah, yeah. Darren Till, he starves himself, literally nearly killed himself. Yeah, I saw that. Too, uh, yeah, because, yeah. like, people go starving because animal products, they have, their calorie, they have a lot of calories in them, they're just like... It's yeah, so much exactly. easier to eat plant foods because they're nutritionally dense and they're, they're low in calories. You can eat a lot of them, so you can fill up your stomach a lot more and you feel yeah. fuller. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, but yeah, I mean, just talk about what you do at the moment and you know, uh, yeah. personal training and stuff. Yeah, so I'm currently I'm personal training at a gym in Bournemouth called uh, New Era. Um, teaching, teaching people boxing, teaching them the basics, building them up into so they've got a good um, understanding of of the sport and also um, helping people lose weight, get fitter, you know, just reach reach their goals that they want. So um, I'm quite busy doing that. It's good, you know. Brings me in, um, keeps me busy, brings me in a, a bit of money, which is great. And um, then I do my own training and boxing fights on the side of that. Yeah, so Sam is going to get on YouTube soon, so we're going to give him some shout out. And uh, we got Beth, his girlfriend here. So hello. Yeah, she's, a, she's, a, she's a vegan and a tattoo artist, so uh, I'm going to link the Instagram and the uh, accounts down below. So uh, what else? Um, I just want to like mention, um, yeah, so like, uh, uh, what else? What else I can think about? Um, yeah, what was it like? So you lived, you lived in Spain for a bit. What was it like? Yeah. We were over in, me and Beth were in Spain for uh, six months or so. Yeah, it was great. It was really good. We were, while well, I was training out there, Beth was tattooing out there. We've, um, We've got a camper van, which is which we were living in, and um, it was lovely in the Spanish sun, you know, um, solar power, so we had battery all day, always fully charged, now we're back in England in the rain and with no electricity, but but yeah, we still, we still make it work. Kicking it in the free world, kicking yeah, it in yeah, the free yeah. world. So, uh, tell us about like, what, like, what's it like living in a van, what's it like? Yeah, the van's good. It's um, freedom. Yeah, yeah, freedom. Yeah, you you get free uh, more freedom, but you sacrifice a bit comfort. of the space and some of the yeah the home comforts that you yeah. get being you know living in a house. But um, it's good, you know. We um, when we have electric, it's great. We have, we've got a shower in there, a toilet. Um, we just need to we just go to a, to our one of our parents' house to fill up the water tank, and that lasts us a few days. You know, using it as a shower and. You know, washing the dishes. Um, we've got a wood burner in there to keep us warm. Um, our kitchen works through a big gas bottle. So, no, this is monopoly. Okay. Yeah, so, uh, you know, to share that. Yeah, yeah, so we'll, like, let, let, know, we gotta, let, 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 um, get in, in a little taste. So, this is a. Uh, what is this? This is a monopoly milkshake. All right. Vegan, of course. Yeah, so what's this place called? Let's right. let's, let's give them a shout out, I guess. Uh, so this is in Bournemouth, you know, we're the, we're the local vegan crew, wow. spreading the message. Uh, I've got Cafe Fry here, so check them out. Uh, I'm actually going to order the Muffy thing. Uh, tomorrow's my birthday, so I just, um, yeah, I haven't gathered up with a bunch of vegans in like, never, to be honest with this. Like, I don't, I don't have time to do anything, really. But, uh, yeah, I mean, um, were you going to get on YouTube? I'd recommend getting on YouTube and 
Oh, can I use some of your like profile pictures too for the thumbs sort of? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah just send it to me. Yeah, yeah. yeah so uh, check out some. I'm going to look into the channel below. Um, I've actually got a YouTube. It's an old one. It's yeah. inactive at the moment. Yeah, you're going to just change but, the name. But yeah, maybe I'll yeah. Um, just build on that because I think there's there's some videos and some some subscribers. Maybe I'll just try and. You, you can build on that. that. Just. Yeah. I think it's about finding a niche. So a lot of people are into boxing, and I'm, I've been yeah, boxing yeah. two years. I love it. It's an awesome sport. It teaches about self defense and like foot movement and Europe. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, what else? I mean, just like it's how to like, a lot of people great for fitness as well. Yeah, it's yeah, really it's good. Like everybody hates cardio. What? Well. No, I, I love cardio. Yeah, I love, I love cardio. Yeah. Some a lot of people that come into the boxing gym they say they hate cardio because as soon as they start punching stuff, they're doing cardio without knowing. Yeah, and they're enjoying it. So yeah. I was doing That's boxing, uh, you know, with Barry. Yeah, Barry Besson. So I did boxing in uh, both amateur boxing club when I was fifteen, and I was. I was getting so slim. I was like, oh, you look anorexic. I used to do like two hours, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, like sparring and all this stuff. And I used to run from the gym to the house, you know, from uh, from Winton to Mordown. Uh, like, yeah, so it's crazy. I was just like, boxing is like, if you want to get super fit and uh, have really good cardio, definitely boxing is the way. I mean, um, yeah, and also teach you about like discipline, right? Like yeah, teamwork yeah. and stuff. Uh, Oh, thank you very much. So do you like eat this or like drink it? Drink so, it yeah, so I've got this uh, Banoffee like mil vegan milkshake. Oh shit. Oh my god, it's like this, uh, it's just dripping. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, so I guess just going to wrap it up. Uh, yeah, so hopefully Sam will go get on YouTube and, uh, you know, show his, you know, just film himself boxing tips and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, get something on there, that's it. So when, when are you thinking of uh, come, going back into fighting again? Um, in the new year, for sure. Um, hopefully, back be back out boxing by um, by March. Yeah. So um, I'm not not rushing back into it. I've um, had a little bit of a break. We moved back to England, obviously, so time to get my um, bit of an income back in and settle down back in England again with uh, my normal clients and stuff, and get some new clients. So then I can comfortably train without having to stress about you know earning money from boxing because it takes a bit of the fun out of it. So, um, how old are you? Uh, it's 26. 26. I'm 20. I'm t tomorrow. I'm 22, guys. I'm getting old. I just, I just feel like I'm, I'm a young man in there, I'm an old man's mind or something like that. But anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed the interview, guys. Uh, share the video. By the way, to all my subscribers, I really appreciate you sticking by. Um, this channel is trying to grow slow. Yeah, it's trying to grow slow. But with me, what my goal is to build a community. You know, like I have a lot of vegan friends and non-vegan friends, of course. But like for me, it's about building a community on the channel. So share the videos with your friends and family and talk about healthy fitness. Look, he's a boxer. He's very successful. Uh, you know, slim, looking good, looking young. Uh, that's the vegan lifestyle for you guys. All right. You can be an app. You can be a professional athlete. You can be an amateur athlete or. Whatever, whatever you want to achieve in life, this lifestyle is the best lifestyle on the planet. There's no doubt about it, especially if you carb up, if you eat enough carbohydrates, if you drink enough water, if you get enough sleep, uh, it's the fucking best lifestyle. Anyway, thanks for tuning by. Hopefully Sam will get a YouTube channel and we'll get his social media going. Get on Twitter, because Twitter is fucking epic. Yeah. You can get a lot of clients through Twitter and stuff like that. So thanks guys for tuning in by. Uh, yeah, more, more videos coming, more shit coming, so stay tuned, alright? Peace!